Okay, all right, all of you seventh graders, man, this haircut is not great. It makes me look like I'm balding. All right, let me make this a little smaller. Okay, all right, here we go. So for all you seventh graders, tonight's homework, I changed the homework, actually. So it's now page, uh, no clue, where is it? Page uh, 343, number four to six, 11 to 16, okay? Yes, okay, that's right. Now, I'm not gonna go over four to six. I think you can manage that yourself just fine. However, I will go over a couple of questions from uh, 11 to uh, 16. Now, let's see what's a good question. All right, 14. Yeah, you know what? Let's do 14, 15, 16. Okay, I think that's good. All right, 14. It's uh, Y. Man, I gotta write this out. All right, okay. Y two minus 3Y equals to negative 8. Am I right? Or am I right? Yep, I'm right. Okay, so let me use... Uh, different marker so you can see. Now I'm gonna find the two families, right? Which is y and negative three y. And then the other family is plus two. So let's see this. All right, so y minus three y, how, how many y's would that be? Right, negative two y plus two equals two. Now I don't even know what I just wrote there. It's negative what? Negative eight, okay. Right, so now you have a two-step equation, right, which you've done last week. So here we'll subtract two from both sides. I cancel those out. I'm left with negative 2y equals 2. Now negative 8 minus 2 is negative 10. Divide both sides by negative 2. y is 5. Okay. So that's the answer. Now you can check the answer technically because you can substitute the y back. So you can substitute five back into the y and you get negative eight as an answer. Okay, so one more. Which one is better? I actually don't know. I think 15 is, let's see, which one is most similar actually? Okay, 16 is more similar to 14. So let's do 15 instead, all right? So number 15, uh, negative 9 minus b plus 8b equals to negative 23. Same family as negative b and positive 8b. And so now, okay, now you can do this actually. Let me let me let me do this one with you guys in, in, in this manner. You can actually just do this first. So 8b minus b or eight, negative 8b plus. Uh, no, negative B plus 8B, that's 7B minus 9. Minus 9 equals to negative 23. So I'm going to add 9 to both sides. So 7b equals to negative 14. And I think all of you know what the answer is already going to be. So it's divided by 7. B is negative 2. So hopefully this will help you um, because I know I went pretty went pretty fast at the end, right? With this combining light term solving equations. So hopefully this will help you with the homework and uh, that way I also don't have to spend too much time on this again tomorrow in class. Okay, so all right, thanks for watching, seventh graders, and uh, have a good one. OMG, that was so good.